Hi everyone, this is Andrew Tan. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to install the latest beta of Crossover for the M1 Apple Silicon Mac. So Crossover is a piece of software that allows you to run Windows applications on the Mac operating system. If you don't know how to set this up, I'll leave a link to my tutorial on how to get Windows games running on the M1 Apple Silicon Mac. Please follow the link in the description for getting this to work. So once you've installed Crossover and you've signed up for an account, what you need to do is to log into your account on the Codeweaver's website. So when you visit this website, what you need to do is to scroll down to the bottom and then what you need to do is to sign up to become a better tester. So just type in your email address, preferably the one that you've used to sign up and pay for crossover and then apply to be a better tester. Once you've logged into the Codeweaver's website and you are accepted into the Better Tester program, you can click on this Better Tester icon here and then you'll have this link to the Beta Center. So just click on the Beta Center. On the left hand side here, we'll have the options to download the application. So we click on the Download button here and then we go on the left hand side. We have the latest crossover download here, 21.1. So we we'll click on this and it's going to download the zip file. So once the file is downloaded, we just need to open up the downloads folder in our finder and then we can double click on this beta file here. So once we've shut down Crossover, we can move this into the Applications folder and replace our existing version of Crossover. So I'm just going to drag this to my Applications folder and then Replace. So once I've replaced it, I can now go into my Applications folder and then double click on Crossover. And then I'm going to click Open. So here it's asking us whether we want to upgrade our bottles. So just be aware that during that process of moving from the public edition to the beta edition or any nightly edition, you're gonna to need to upgrade your bottle. And this has a possibility of corrupting the data inside it. So just be aware of that. I'm gonna click upgrade here because I've not had issues with this in the past. And I've got crossover open and this is the 21.1 beta. So that's now installed. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.